Mm -hmm. Food check. Good. Decoration. Yeah, it's ready. Decoration check. Good. Cutlery is set. Yes. All good. I am ready. Are you? What's up people, this is Bijan and welcome to my channel Wizmonk. Today I am going to whiz you away with 5 tips on how to be a good host for a memorable party with your friends and families. And people who are new to my channel, this channel is all about wistful tips and tricks for a fit and fashionable wholesome life. So be curious and stay tuned till the end. Know and create your guest list. A great group of people will make any party success, even if the food and decor is a flop. Having people over with whom you can spend a comfortable and fun time is what creates special memories. Know your guest food preference, if any. Prep for the meal in advance so that you don't fall back on the day of the event. When you invite people over the phone, in person, via email, never forget to provide important information like date, time, place, location, the occasion the party is for, and also not to forget the dress code, if any. You don't want to be panicked by people arriving late or early. Invitations can get tricky, where AM to PM or date month can be misunderstood if not stated clearly. For instance, 11th December can be easily misunderstood as 12th November if used short form. That's why it's very important that you send a clear invitation. Greeting your guests warmly instantly relaxes them and makes them feel welcome. Be attentive to their situation and take actions. Whether it's refilling an empty glass or empty plate or even having a conversation with the silent one in the group. Never fall back from taking action because action means you are a good host looking after your guests. If you have an uninvited guest or your friend arrives with an unexpected guest, be gracious to receive them as no polite host would return a guest. Be flexible enough to incorporate special requests like preparing the food as per your guest tastes or allowing pet entry or something else. A good host will want their guest to have a good time and leave your party with a happy heart and a big smile on their face. What better way to show you care than with a beautifully set up place? Try to create a dining space that is appealing to the eye and also cozy at the same time. Use tableware that is clean and in proper shape and shine because no one likes to eat off dirty. Build a setting where both food and cutlery are handy so that you can enjoy the food with your guest while it is still warm. And the much awaited the wistful tip. This year's festive season is little different than other years. Whopping parties will be on pause for some time, but what matters is you spend quality time with your loved ones and create special memories. When you arrange your settings, keep in mind social distancing, wear mask when going outdoors, and maintain a high level of hygiene with frequent sanitization and hand washing. I wish you all have a healthy and happy holiday season. Stay safe my friends. Thank you my friends for joining me today on how to be a good host. And if you really like this video, please go ahead and smash that like button, share and subscribe to my channel. And most importantly, 
don't forget to hit the bell icon to stay tuned for more interesting tips and tricks for that buzzing live useful life which i promised you so until next week adios amigos signing off your wisdom